A Russian court has given two year suspended sentence to a St. Petersburg woman who left notes saying they raised freaks and errs at the grave of President Vladimir Putin's parents. He points Irina Tsibaneva notes on the guarded tomb on the eve of Mr. Putin's birthday. In October, Irina Tsibaneva placed note of the preserved tomb on eve of Mr. Putin's birthday in October saying Mr. Putin had caused so much pain and trouble and the whole world is praying for his death. Mr. Putin has caused so much pain and trouble and the whole world is praying for his death. Critics say the Kremlin's sweeping campaign effectively blames criticism of the war on Thursday. The court found 60-year-old Irina Tsibaneva guilty of holy burials motivated by political hatred. Prosecutors received a suspended sentence of three years. Her lawyer said did not plead guilty because she did not physically sanctify the tomb or seek publicity for her act, said. Sibaneva made a note on the preserved grave on the eve of Mr. Putin's birthday in October. Parents of a maniac, take him to your place, he read. According to the Sota News site, Sibaneva does not plan to appeal against the decision. According to another news outlet, he wrote note after watching the news about war in Ukraine and realized that everything was very scary, everything was very sad, and there were many dead. Actor placed on extremists and terrorists list since Mr. Putin sent troops to Ukraine in February 2022, the government has run a crack on the opposition, unseen since Soviet times. In another case, a Russian government agency added actor Artur Smolyaninov and a former advisor to the Ukrainian presidency to its list of extremists and terrorists. Smolyaninov stated an interview with European edition of the independent Russian newspaper Novaya Gazeta in January that he would hypothetically take part hostilities only on Ukrainian side. Ukraine's presidential advisor, Alexei Arestovich, resigned after stating online that a Russian missile hit a residential building due to Ukrainian air defenses, killing 45 people in the city of Dnipro. In other developments Thursday, Russian military court sentenced Nikita Tushkinov, a history teacher from Komi, to five and a half years in prison for comments he made last year about explosion of the Ketch Bridge, which connects Ukrainian Crimean Peninsula with mainland Russia. Tushkinov was found guilty of justifying terrorism and discrediting the Russian military. The teacher called her social media posts a birthday present for the bridge blowout for Mr. Putin in October. Russian opposition leader Alexei Navalny was found guilty of and contempt of court. Also Thursday, opposition leader Alexei Navalny reported on Twitter that he was extradited to a criminal cell just a day after he was released from one of them. Navalny, 46, who faced official corruption and staged massive anti-Kremlin protests, was arrested Moscow January 2021 after recovering from nerve agent Poi.